A grand jury indicting a Bear County couple for what the DA calls horrific injuries to a 21-month-old little girl. If convicted, Isaac Cardenas and Crystal Herrera could face up to life in prison. Cardenas faces two counts of super aggravated sexual assault of a child. Herrera, the victim's own mother, one count of injury to a child causing serious bodily injury by omission. The couple at first claimed injuries to the child's private areas were caused by a dog attack. Investigators say the injuries don't match that story, but are consistent with a brutal sexual assault. The little girl still hospitalized seven weeks after she was hurt. As Dylan Collier tells us in this Crime Fighters report, word of this indictment first came this morning at a rally calling attention to April being Child Abuse Prevention Month. Framed by volunteers holding signs quoting the pain suffered by victims of child abuse and neglect, members of the Blue Ribbon Task Force on Child Abuse outlined grim statistics. In 2016, 222 children in Texas died as a result of abuse or neglect. That's 51 more than the year before. 11 of these children were our very own kids from Bear County. Already this year, San Antonio police are investigating nearly 350 cases of sexual abuse of children and close to 150 cases of other types of child abuse. That is just unfathomable and we have to prevent that from happening. Bringing down and those numbers starts with something simple each of us can do. Don't keep your mouth shut when you see this happening. Report it. District Attorney Nico LaHood says the change at the Bear County Courthouse is impacting those who abuse or neglect children. In 2014, he says there were just 47 felony child abuse trials with only a 57% conviction rate. Last year saw nearly double that many, 82 in all, with a 73% conviction rate. 19 of those convicted getting a sentence of 20 years or more in prison. Dylan Collier, KSAT 12 News.